All right, what is up, guys? It's Pete TNZ here, and you're gonna see some gameplay in the background. That's me using the Atlas. Just got an elite version. Uh, the Rossi, I think. And if you hear buttons, that's basically just like recording commentary over the shirt play thing or whatever. Blah blah blah. And you might hear some buttons. I'm not sure. But these are my Black Ops 3 expectations and hopes or ideas or whatever. And yeah. So, um, first hope. No, first expectation. I hope this game will be very consistent. And by consistent, I mean there's no randomly changing a gun end up being good or bad. Because if you guys know, in the Black Ops 2, when it first started, S12 used to be a super strong weapon. It's still kind of strong now, but not as strong as it used to be. So, it's, it used to be always be basically a one shot. Now it's now it's a two shot, and it's 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 kind of bad now. I mean, if you, like you have you basically have to spray pretty much at least hold to like half your clip even up close to kill one person. And holy crap, I didn't know my time was 68.8, 676.8. That's pretty long. And yeah, and I don't. I don't want it to, you know, I don't want it to be inconsistent. Okay. And that's one thing. Hope. When it comes to Nuke Channel, we all know that Nuke Channel is coming out for Black Ops 3. And it's. I hope it's the same. I don't want Nuke Channel to be any different from what it was before. If they do add anything, what I want to add is them getting on the roof. And holy crap, my time is a lot more better with the more. And, yeah. I don't, I don't want anything extra happening to Nuke Town at all. Like, I don't think it would be fun, you know? I mean, getting on the roof would be, getting on the roof would be freaking amazing. Don't get me wrong. Or, I mean, they could probably expand the map, but I would like it to keep it completely original. I wouldn't like it to, you know, somehow be changed in any form or fashion. It wouldn't be as fun to me. And, yeah, I wouldn't want to want to be that like that. Another thing, uh, I hope there are ballistic knives. And so far, there's been like no confirmation about the ballistic knives or anything, which I'm 100% hoping there are because I am in fact a knifer and a sniper, which I'm surprised to be both because a lot of people, most most in the college community, hate one another, or at least out of my friends. The snipers hate the knifers, the knifers hate the snipers, and I'm both. So. So my friends even have an experience about me in Call of Duty. <laughs> I didn't. Um. Yeah. I mean, I do not want. I really want there to be ballistic knives. I mean, ballistic knives would not be fun to me if it uh if it was. But um if there wasn't, I mean. I mean, just to try something new, like, after I get done being try hard and prestiging a crap ton of Black Ops 3, I want to be able to fool around in Black Ops 2. Like, now in Black Ops 2, I just go on with Ballistic Knives. Just go on Free For All, Ballistic Knives, and Tomahawk. All I do. I mean, I, and I win a few. And it's fun for me, because one, it gives me a challenge, and two, it shows some, like, actual skill. I mean, not saying that anything else doesn't, but when it comes to Tomahawks and stuff, it takes a lot more skill. A lot more than... Than, than probably quick scoping with a sniper. I mean, that's what it feels like to me at least, but I could be wrong. Some people actually feel hard when it comes to quick scoping and stuff like that, but that's besides the point. Um, uh, another thing. Now, I hope the animation won't be weird when, you know, people are like wall, uh, wall running. And I know a lot of people aren't worried about that at all, but, you know, 
I don't want the character to like kind of look like how like a ghost female character look like, very skinny and like easy to cut corners and it was kind of like kind of hard to shoot her. Her character model was super confusing because it looked like you would hit her, but you'll end up missing her by like her waist or something like that, and it was it was it was really crazy. It was it was it was a big surprise, and. Yeah, it was just, it was just a surprising, surprising thing, because, like, it's, another thing, this is just my personal hope, uh, I personally am a big, like, Modern Warfare 3 fan, Modern Warfare 3 and Modern Warfare 2 are, like, my favorites, and I know a lot of people are going to be, like, Black Ops 2 better, but I'm always into the Modern Warfare series, I actually want Infinity War to come back, I just, I don't know what they're doing. I'm scared that they're not going to be back. I could really use another good old style Modern Warfare. But who knows if they're going to have it or not. Uh, this is my last thing. This is my personal hope. When it comes to like the Tomahawks, I, I want to know if it's going to be like Black Ops 3 or Black Ops 2. If I'm going to have to actually, you know, do some math and like actually know where to throw it so i'm gonna have to actually lean it up a lot or throw it straight at them and like i said i'm a knifer i really care about that thoroughly and yeah that's pretty much it that's my expectation again close to hitting 50 hit tip hooray and i hope you guys like the gameplay in the background i was i think i have some pretty good runs that's what I think. I think that's some pretty good ones. Oh, actually, I got one more thing. Uh, the killing time. Uh, I don't know if the killing time is gonna be what Chaos X Silencer says. If you guys don't know him, I think I think he's some kind of like Call of, secret Call of Duty player because whatever the community says goes off him. They they usually end up doing or something like that, and it's crazy that they do it. It's like that they that the people who created the game actually like you know, do what he says, or like, listen to the community a little bit, and the killing time, they, I believe most people pick ghost killing time, I want to see if they actually want to do that or not, I mean, I, I mean, I wasn't, I was, at first I wasn't really a big fan of Black Ops 2, I am now, because you, you could always, I forgot that I missed so many times trying to hit him, oh, I hate it that I tell you, and, you know, if you have exosuits, you want to be able, you think you should actually, like, be able to move and run this. I mean, you got to exo for crying out loud. You should be able to move. You should be able to quickly get in and out if you need to. I mean, I know it's not the same as Advanced Warfare. You know, you can't do, you know, all that other stuff and crap. And, yeah. So, um, yeah, that's, that's it right there, I'm sure. So, that's all I really got to say. And, yeah. Wow. Oh, wow, I just missed all those shots. Forgot about that. Forgot about that. <laughs> Alright, well, that's it, see you later, and goodbye.